Ella P. Stewart was a phenomenal woman. Ella P. Stewart started school at the age of 12, going to Stewart College to become a teacher. But as we know, her path took her in a different direction where she became one of the first African-American pharmacists in the United States. To this day, um, I'm in awe of all that she was able to accomplish within her lifetime. So when the school was created, they had an Ella P. Stewart Museum. And we were getting a new school building. That was one thing that we negotiated was to make sure that the museum stayed intact and in place. The things that you see in the museum are all from her world travels. And she was an ambassador um, around the country, received many awards and accolades, and those things are housed here in this museum. But what I hope is that they can see all that she's accomplished, but to see that it's nothing that is too far reach for them to achieve as well. So when they see that she made those accomplishments and was able to continue her education to become a pharmacist and eventually be recognized with an honorary doctorate degree, that it's not just exposing the students here to a career, but to a person's character and how far that can take you. I am Shannon Carter and I am TPS Proud.